Hello. Good evening. Hello, hello. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? Um, so, well, um, I, I am dream, sueño. Ah, you are like a sleepy. Asleep. Uh, sleep. Sleepy. A sleepy. Yeah, it's kind of sleepy, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, 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 okay. But I am here, okay. ready. That is good. For two hours. Two hours. How is the weather there? It's very fine. I live in, in San Salvador. Okay. Near to Su. Su. Near to the Su. Okay. The National Su. Mm -hmm. Si, sí, National Su. Okay. So okay. it's fine. Okay. Nice. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. And you, teacher? Okay, right here. Today? Uh, yeah, it was kind of busy, but uh, in the afternoon was a kind of relax, you know. And the weather right now is really hot right here. But at the same time, uh, I'm listening to uh, something like Turner Storm that, that uh, mean that maybe it's raining. Where do you live? I live in the north area of Susulutan. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Susulutan. Oh, yeah, so far away from San Salvador. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it, it is in the, in the east area. For that reason, it's really hard, hot right here because I'm in the middle between Usulutan and San Miguel, you know? Yes, I visit um, many times on uh, on the year. Okay. Uh, San Miguel okay. and La Unión because my family like the beach. Okay. Coco beach oh. or, or spin beach? Uh, las tunas, no, las tunas, el espino, el tamarindo. Uh, my family and I go to the beach uh, three or, or two days. Okay, nice. It's very beautiful. Yeah, yeah. The best beach of the country. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Okay. 
Hola, teacher. Buenas noches. Buenas noches a todos. Hello, Diana. How are you? Bien, teacher. Solo que he salido ahorita de del escalón <ríe> y calculo llegar a, a la casa como en una 40 minutos. Ok. Ajá, solo, ajá, solo voy a estar conectada. Trataré de participar lo más posible en lo que llego a la casa. Ok, ya tienen la asistencia. Ah, bueno. <ríe> Gracias, teacher. Ok, ok. Ok, uh, we were talking uh, uh, in the way that I see the, the weather, maybe we can have a, a power off. Cuando sucede eso, que se oyen truenos y como que llueve, de repente se va la energía. En este sector siempre pasa eso. Pero esperemos que hoy no suceda. Generalmente uh, en la zona norte está llena de bastantes fincas uh, de café y, y partes son como que, como que se cuecen montañas pequeñas. Entonces, como está poblado de vegetación, siempre la lluvia, cuando hay lluvia, en estas zonas son más fuertes. Y por eso es que se da ese tipo de, 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 de fenómenos así, que la energía de repente no falla, pero... Ahorita más que todo se oye como que si fuese en la parte sur de Usulután y quizás en una parte de San Miguel se oye que está tronando mucho. But we are here ready to continue working with all of you. No escucho, tengo problemas de audio, dice Stephanie Sánchez. Hello, Stephanie. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Pero sí, teacher, yo visito bastante Oriente. Me gusta. Ok, 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 ok. Nice. It's, It's really hot. Bonito. You know, in this, in this, yes. this time of eh, eh, the year, always, yeah, it's, always. it's really hot. But the view yeah. is very beautiful. Yeah. Los mangos. Um, Hemos visitado varias, varias playas y más que todo con, en hoteles por, por lo mismo, por el calor. Okay. Es muy bonito. Yes. Yes, it is. Ok. We are going to invite the rest of people to visit las playas de Oriente. Yes. Ok. Let me see. Walter. How are you, Walter Mauricio? Walter, Walter. Oh. Hello, hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, I am fine. You are fine. And they, and they relax. Okay, you are relaxed. Uh, very good. They very good. Uh, my family, my son, my wife. Uh, excellent. Yeah. Okay. That is good. Okay. That is good to hear that. Okay. Okie dokie. A, a teacher, a teacher, excuse me. Tell me. Uh, and soccer playing you? I used to play soccer, my friend. But oh. I saw something that was really terrible. It happened like, let me see, like four years ago. I was in, a, I, I belong to a team of teacher. Uh, of Minel, and we used to play uh -huh. in some uh, soccer field in, in San Miguel. Okay. Yeah, that day I have a compromise and I couldn't go. And I asked a friend of mine to go. And after uh -huh. he started playing soccer, two minutes after, somebody broke his leg. Oh, and for that reason, I decided stopping playing soccer, you know. <laughs> okay. Sí, fíjese que yo jugaba en un equipo del magisterio de, 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 de Ministerio de Educación y eso fue hace cuatro años. Y ese día yo no podía ir a jugar y le dije a un compañero que fuera. 
y bueno, generalmente los partidos se hacían en San Miguel, en unas canchitas corona que hay ahí por la Rubel. Y tenía dos minutos de haber entrado al juego él, cuando de repente llega un tipo por detrás y le quiebra la pierna. Entonces, oh, oh my God. Él pasó como seis meses, quizás oh. más, en cama. Y entonces dije yo, no, este es un mensaje para mí, así es que a colgar los guantes y a no jugar más. Y no toca. Yeah, and I stay here. It's better, you know. Oh, okay. But Wilfredo continue playing, yeah. Ahora solo mira. Ahora, <laughs> Ahora solo fans. Ahora solo me toca a mí hilar como el chinito. Aguilucho de corazón. Mm, fíjese que... No, no lo es, porque él es de su Sí, sí, fíjese ah, que generalmente... Sí, generalmente, como le dije a, a, a ella, estoy en el medio de los dos departamentos, en el borde de los dos, entre Usulután y San Miguel, en la zona norte. Entonces, ah, ah, pues... Pero es del Paz. Ah. <risa> ah, no, no te oigo, no, no te oigo. No, puro pampero. No va. I'm going to keep it in secret, you know. Lo vamos a mantener así en secreto <laughs> para, para, okay, no, okay, para okay, no entrar okay. ahí no, en, no, no, no. En, en polémica with anyone. Jesus, <laughs> it's raining. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear. No sé si pueden oír los truenos. Yes. <laughs> yes, teacher. Yes? Yes, teacher. Uh, yes, yeah, right here. Listen. Yeah, maybe, uh, let me see, five kilometers maybe, it's raining. Oh. Yeah, okay. We try to do our best. Okay. If the power uh, suddenly go off, I'm going to try to get in again. Si se va la energía, pues, vamos a tratar de entrar lo más rápido que regrese, okay? And right now, let me check out the, the assistant. Ada Daisy is there. Ada Daisy, hello. Are you present? No? My person. Alec, Ada? Ada Daisy is here? Jesus. Right. Can you hear that, that, that noise? Yes, teacher. Yes? Yes. Okay, 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 okay. Are, are the Daisy is not here? No, okay. Alexis Antonio? Alexis, Alexis. Yes, teacher. Okay, it's present. Uh, no, Roxana? Roxana? Present, teacher. Okay, uh, Cristiano Obdulio? Christian, you know, here, okay. Diana Carolina is present. She's listening. In, present teacher. Yeah, it's listening in, 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 his, in her phone. Edward Ademir. Edward, Edward. Maybe he's in a Kahutla court, in a Kahutla court. Eliani, Eliani, are you there? Eliani. Eliani. Fausto. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, sir. Uh, Felicita is not here. Oh, Felicita? No. Uh, Francisco Javier. Francisco. Are you there, Francisco? Enara, 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 eh, Helen Maria, Karen Yesenia, Karen, what about yesterday? Fire Linter, teacher. Okay, 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 Fire Linter, okay, okay. Carla Marielos. 
expresan. Ok, Carla. Leslie. 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 Now. Uh, Mengibar Contreras. Present. There, uh, Gutierrez Sánchez. Gutierrez Sánchez. It's not here. Rosa Esperanza. I'm present, teacher. Okay, thank you. Walter Mauricio Morales. Present, present too. And Wilfredo Guardado is there. Okay. This is the assistant for today. Okay, let me see what we gonna going to talk about today. Okay. Listen this question. Is the word etiquette familiar to you? Is the word etiquette familiar to you? No, <laughs> no. In Spanish, we call uh, when we let me let me see in this way. Let me explain you in this way. Uh, as you can see now nowadays, most of the communication with the student is virtual, right? And for that reason. Uh, we as teacher, we need to know some netiquetas, it's called in Spanish, that, that tell us as a teacher what we can do and what we can do. Yeah. In this case, I'm talking about etiquette in your workplace. Etiquette. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Is that word etiquette familiar to you? Um, Chami? La palabra etiqueta es familiar con usted? More, more. <laughs> more or less? More or less, more or less. Okay. Who, want, who wants to tell me something about this? Alguien quiere decirme teacher, algo? A, a question, teacher, a question. Walter. Eh, eh, etiqueta eh, eh, se refiere a, a my presentation in the personal? Uh, it is something like okay. kind of rule that tell us the way that we need to behave in our job. Son como una wow. especie de reglas que nosotros debemos de seguir. Okay, okay, teacher, thank you. Etiquetas, ajá, las etiquetas que debemos de usar. Okay, tell me. Teacher. Rules etiquette, uh, teacher. Okay, Rosa, tell me. Uh, Rules etiquette. Okay. I got your message. Yeah. Does it? Does it? So. Okay. Wilfredo, tell me. I am going to say you if uh, when you talk about a ticket, it's like a behavior. I remember yesterday we talked about. Ah, we talk about that, you know. Yeah. Yes. It's like a talk about behavior, or because uh, yesterday, yesterday you told us that behavior is like a. Comportamiento. Conducta. Conducta. Yeah, also. Ah, bueno, esperemos que no se nos vaya la energía. Cada vez que siento que viene avanzando más la, 
quizás será la primera tormenta, no, no la primera tormenta de este, de este año, pero al menos por esta zona generalmente siempre comienza a llover antes que en todos los lugares, porque tenemos el, el Cerro El Tigre y la Sierra Tecapa Chinameca. Entonces, esa es una de las razones por las cuales las tormentas son atraídas por esa vegetación. It is But, raining, teacher, near, yeah, near, 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 my, near my house is raining. Near your house? Yes. Hey, good. It is, it is good. I, I like to see the, the rain. Yeah, the raining. I, yeah, I like. Yeah, the, there is a song the, from Freedom that is called, Have You Ever Seen the Rain? Have you heard that? Have you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that, yeah. That, the song? Have you ever seen the rain? Yeah. It, 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 yeah, yeah. It, 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 yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. It's really nice. I love <laughs> Yeah. It's, it's, it's start to rain right now. Yeah, okay, but, but maybe we are going to have problem with the power. Well, the reason I don't want it, but the weather is going to be cool. Okay, yeah. going back again to the topic. I don't know if you want to tell me something else about it. Or I don't know what, uh, when you listen this word, what comes to your mind? ¿Qué le viene a la mente cuando oye la palabra etiquette? Okay, you already told me the yeah. about behavior. How, how, um, how the, ¿cómo dice? ¿Cómo tomar la cuchara? <laughs> Ah, okay. How to use the spoon? Como tomar el tenedor, qué tenedor how, usar para el. <laughs> how to use forks? Para para el para el refrigerio, otra para el para la comida principal. Yeah, I, I got you. I got you. What you are trying to tell me, right? Okay. Yeah, but in this case, we are going to focus our attention in uh, the way that we are going to behave in our work, in our workplaces, you know, in a, in a general way. But it's pretty good what you are saying, okay? Somebody else want to share something with me? Um, education or norms of behavior. Okay, 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 okay. Excellent. That's it. Uh, That's all. Regulation uh, into okay. the company. Okay, Walter, tell me, Walter. Tell me, Walter. Uh, regulation into the company. Okay. Okay, could be. What else? I have a lot of people. Let me see four people that I need that. Well, if so, if you are traveling right now in the bus or if you are driving, uh, maybe it's really difficult for you to turn on your camera, but as soon as you arrive to your house, so please turn on your cameras. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Somebody else want to tell me something about it? No? Let me see. Somebody writing. No escucho. Tengo problemas de audio. No, teacher. Can you hear me very well? Yes? Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Right here, it start to rain right now. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, we are in number one. Is the word etiquette familiar to you? Mention two rules of etiquette at your workplace. Are these rules important and why? 
Okay, but because of the time, uh, we are going to read exercise number two. Read the article on workplace etiquette with the links. The identification delay. Okay, uh, let me see. Right here. Read the article on workplace etiquette guideline. Then identify the key detail to answer the comprehension question. Okay. The title say good etiquette at the workplace. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you have had an emergency, that is okay. However, official late comers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority and report the reason why you are late. Okay, I'm going to stop here because I need that uh, you get familiar with this vocabulary. But before to continue, I would like to ask you if you are listening, listen well, or I don't know if you are listening to any kind of interference. Antes de continuar, me gustaría saber si me están oyendo bien o me están oyendo con interferencia. Le dije hace Yo lo escucho un bien, Yo lo escucho dicho. bien, dicho. Yo lo escucho dije, bien, dicho. Hace un momentito uh, ha iniciado la lluvia. Acá está eh, cayendo una lluvia. Ya el clima hizo su cambio. Y eh, quiero que en el momento que no sé, me esté oyendo bien, me, me digan, por favor. ¿Ok? Ok, teacher. No problem. Okay. Don't worry about the reading. I'm going to read it as many times uh, uh, as I can. In order that you get familiar with all the pronunciation of the words. I don't know if you have any questions so far right here. Yes, teacher. Um, in the part that says, then a good etiquette get line will be to call the concerned authority. Okay, let me see. Al final del primer párrafo. Yeah, 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 yes. If you know that you delay right here. Uh -huh. this? Yes, um, me estaba viendo el diccionario yes. y Concerned Authority me sale como autoridad y el otro interesada. Entonces, no sé, la idea es, será como llamado de atención, algo así. Mm. O, o no. estoy mal. No, 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 no. no. If you know that you will be late, si usted sabe que llegará tarde, then a good etiquette guideline will be, una buena guía de etiqueta sería llamar a la autoridad pertinente. Yeah, in this case, imagine that you are going to be late. Uh, you can call to your boss or supervisor and tell him or tell her uh, what is happening. Entonces usted le va a llamar a su supervisor o a su jefe y le va a decir el problema que tiene. Entonces, esa es una buena etiqueta, ¿no? Ah, ok. Ok. okay. okay. Gracias. Ok, ok. Somebody, somebody ha have any question? Sure. Ok. I'm going to say in Spanish. Ok, uh, tell me in Spanish. Don't worry about it. Es como cuando tienen a alguien 
marcado literalmente o porque llega tarde. Yes. O al contrario. Yeah. Cuando alguien es puntual o está siempre antes. ¿Te refiere a eso cuando nosotros podemos hablar de, de, de etiquette uh, guideline? Para, para, voy a seguir en español. ¿Se puede usar para, o como para etiquetar bien a una persona o etiquetarla mal? Yes. All the pen. All the pen. Okay. okay. Somebody else want to tell me something about this paragraph? La pronunciación correcta es etiquette guideline. Yeah. In my case, I say etiquette guideline. Etiquette. Etiquette. But if you want, etiquette. you can say etiquette. But yeah, etiquette. Así, que, así es la pronunciación correcta. Etiquette. Guideline. Yeah, in, in, in American, in American English, it's etiquette. Gracias. Okay, hold on a second because I need to Habilita el micrófono, ni a Rosita, que no se le escucha nada. Yeah, no. The problem is that eh, the, the noise es, of the raining. Es, es, que, es que es la lluvia, por lo que no se le escucha. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, to, to do something else in order that you can listen to me. Good evening, okay. guys. Okay, we are going to continue. Okay, we are going to start in this paragraph. Etiquette is also important. When you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world, in those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace, email, etiquette of other countries. In uh, in the official email, you need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and grammatically correct language for email. What can you tell me about this paragraph? Yes, Hello. Uh, se le escucha, teacher. Okay, Cortado. Okay. okay uh, can you tell me something about this paragraph? Yes, teacher. <ríe> Cuando le dice, tú tienes que tener conocimiento del lugar, 
no entiendo la idea de the workplace email etiquette of other countries. Okay. Como los, las, las, lo que hay que usar en los correos según el lugar de las, de las otras personas. No sé la idea, no, no la entiendo. Como si es del tipo de escritura, como gramatical y como si es de la escritura. Que hay que la okay. escritura correcta y el lenguaje correcto al usar los correos, algo así. Ah, ah, pero, ah bueno, pero eso es al final. No, yo digo la, no, yo digo justo la idea después de que dice eh, tener un buen conocimiento de lugar, uh -huh. email, etiquette of other countries. Esa, ah, ok, ajá. Es, no, no, no le logro ajá. captar la idea. ¿Qué quiere decir ahí en esa línea? De otros países. Ok, I'm going to read the next uh, paragraph. In addition, knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the phone at some point during our daily work and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpretation. Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your co-workers. If you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not talk loudly while eating. And remember to close your mouth when you shoot. You should remember that your behavior and manner are under observation. Following etiquette guidelines can play a very vital role for future promotion. Okay. I am I'm going to read it again. Lo voy a leer una vez más y me voy a ir deteniendo donde están los puntos. A fin de que si tienen algún problema en pronunciación, me puedan hacer las preguntas respectivas. Hello. Hello. Hello, teacher. I can hear you. I don't know why. But maybe I need to. I'm trying to use uh, another kind of equipment. Okay, let me try. I'm going to try to use my my headphones because it's difficult for the raining to listen to you well. I'm gonna to try to use this. Okay, hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, much better. Okay. Hello. I, I like that. I like that. Can you hear me very well? Me pueden oír muy bien? Yes. Yes. Hear you well. Yes. Okay. 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 As I told you, cause the rainy, uh, I can hear you very well. But right now, I can do it. As I told you before, I'm going to read again, and I'm going to make some stop in every point. If you have any question about how to pronounce a word, just let me know. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm going to start. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you had an emergency, that is okay. However, 
Heavy chalet commerce are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concern authority and report the reason why you are late. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I have a volunteer who wants to read it for me, this paragraph, in order that you can uh, get familiar with these words. Don't worry about uh, mistakes. Don't worry about it. Necesito que vayamos practicando la lectura. No se preocupen por los errores. Eso es the humans. But the most important thing is that you practice reading, okay? Yes. Okay, who wants to do it? Who wants to do it? There are money. Oh, a dog is barking. Okay, who wants to read it for me? The first paragraph? Me, teacher. Okay, Diana, tell me. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most import, important is to be punctual, punctual uh, oh. to your office. If you are late because uh, you are you have an emergent, emergency, emergency, there is okay. emergency. Emergency. Emergency, that is okay. However, habitual late comers are never appreciated appreciat in any organization. Okay. If, I'm, I'm if gonna, you, uh, okay, sorry. go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Do it, if do it. you get to your office on time, you show that, that you are responsible responsible and you respect the organization if you know that you will be late then a good etiquette, etiquette, etiquette uh, guideline will be to call the concert authority and report the reason why are you why why are why you are late okay nice Thank, Thank you. Bueno. Okay, there are some words that you... Uh... Me, teacher. The okay. second paragraph. Happy show. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, oh, first. Okay, do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. First or second? Uh, third one. Etica, etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace, email, etiquette of other countries. In the official email, you need to mention the subject clearly and be consistent. You also need to include, include uh, the important details. You should use formal and grammatical correct language for emails. Okay, thank you. Somebody else want to read? Alguien más quiere leer? My teacher. Okay. In first, second, uh, three. Okay, let us read number three in addition. In, in addition, collection of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during, during our daily work. 
be polite when you tell to your employees or your supervisor listen to way they say careful and do not interrupt be sure your voice is clear when you speak about your own enterprise okay interpreter somebody else uh, be conscious teacher meet teacher okay edward welcome tell me Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your co-workers. If you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not talk loudly while eating, eating. And remember to close your mouth when you kill. You should remember that your behavior and manners are under observation following etiquette guidelines can play a very vital role for future promotions promotions okay okie dokie i am going to read it again for you se lo voy a leer una vez más i know that uh, we have a lot of swear here, but you are going to get familiar with the pronunciation of each word, okay? I'm going to read again. There are many wordplays, etiquette guideline, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you have an emergency, that is okay. However, habitual latecomers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concern authority and report the reason why you are late. Etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace email etiquette of other countries. In the official email, you need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important detail. You should use formal and grammatically correct language for image, language for email, okay. Let me see the rest. In addition, knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We had to speak on the telephone on some point during our daily work. Be polite. When you talk to your employees or your supervisor, listen to what they said carefully. And do not interrupt. Be sure your boy is clear when you speak to a boy run interpretation. Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your coworker. If you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not talk loudly while eating. And remember to close your mouth when you shoot. You should remember that your behavior and manners are under observation. Following etiquette guidelines can play a very vital role for future promotion. Okay. Any question to this reading? Hello? Hola? No question, teacher. No question, no question. Okay. Okay, I need a volunteer who wants to start reading again the paragraph number one. 
de los que no han participado que quieran leerme el párrafo 1, por favor. Me teacher. Tell me. Ok. Uh, there are many workplace dedicated by lamb, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you are emergency. That's it. However, everyone late comments are never a practice in any organization. If you go to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you res respect the organization. If you know that you will be like being good ticket good night with to be called the constant authority and report the reason which you are late. Okay, thank you, sir. Okay, somebody else wants to read the same paragraph. Alguien más quiere leer el mismo párrafo? Me teacher. Okay, uh, as, soon, as soon as you read, Tan pronto usted comience a leer, los demás compañeros le van prestando atención y van a ir eh, oyendo diferentes formas eh, de cómo eh, algunos de ustedes van pronunciando. Entonces ustedes mismos, sin necesidad de irle diciendo al otro, ustedes se van a ir corrigiendo solos y van a decir, ah, esa palabra no es así, esta es así. Ok, entendemos eso. Comencemos. Ok. Eh, there are many... Workplace, Erike, Erike, eh, se me olvidó cómo se dice esta palabra. Guidelines. 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 There, there are many workplaces, Erike, guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you lay because you have an emergency, that is okay. However, habitual lay course are never appreciated in any organization. If you go to your office on time, you show doubt to your responsibility and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette that lay will be to call the concert authority and report the rate ra the of what you are lay. Okay. Okay, repeat this word for me. Reason. 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 Authority. 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 This is a letter P. Con una letra Z. Authority. 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 Ok, 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 ok. Ok. Somebody else? The last one, the last one for this activity. ¿Alguien más que quiera leer? May I try, teacher? Ok, Wilfredo, go ahead, sir. Ok. There are many good plays, etiquette, guide or guide, but the most important is to, is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you had an emergency, that is okay. However, habitual late commerce are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority and report the reason why you are late. Okay. Okay. That is nice. 
remember that in this kind of work we are going to apply also a rule similar a rule that I already explained you with a uh, regular bear when the sound end in T or D in this key appreciate it appreciate it appreciate it yeah and this one oh, is okay. habitual habitual Habi habitual 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 okay habitual okay and this one is however okay okay okay, okay. keep it in mind thank you Okay, any questions so far right here? Hello? Uh, what the meaning um, C H E W C H E W shoe when you shoe. Sh when you shoe okay 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 hold on hold on hold on i'm going to stop chilling. okay can you see my face okay can you see my face yes. yes okay take a look what i'm doing what am i doing uh, masticando a uh, shoe yeah <laughs> okay when you are shoe Ahora sí se comprende la expresión. Yes. ¿Qué es lo que nos dice que, 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 debe, que no debemos de hacer cuando estamos masticando? Abrir la boca. Ah, ah ok. Ok. Let us see. Do not talk loudly when you eat it. And remember, to close your mouth when you are chewing. Yeah. Cierra tu boca cuando okay. tú masticas. Yeah. Okay. What else? Somebody else? Anybody? Any question? Hola. No question. Okay. Entonces, no question. Ah, okay. I'm going to ask you some question then. Okay. Let us see this activity. Number one. Ah, uh, but let me let me read the instruction here first. In letter B said, then identify the key details to answer the comprehension question. We need to identify the key details to answer the comprehension question. Okay. Necesitamos identificar como los puntos claves. Okay, let me ask you this question. If you know that you are late, you should letter A, compensate the time, letter B, call the person you report to, or letter C, not do anything about it. Don't tell me now, don't tell me now. I know that you... You know the answer, but just hold on a second. Todavía no me responda. Yo sé que ahí tiene la respuesta. Okay. Number two. What is a tip to apply in official email? Send the email in English. Let it be. Use a long salutation. And let it see. Express the subject clearly. And we have two more i guess let me see okay number three which is not good etiquette when you talking when you talking on the phone letter a speaking using clear voice letter b interrupt the other speaker letter c use polite language number four if you receive a call while you are eating with coworker, you should letter A, ignore the call and continue eating. Letter B, answer the call at the table. And letter C, leave the table and answer the call. Okay. Now that I finish, what can you tell me? What is what was easy for you to answer 
uh, this question. Fue fácil para usted encontrar la respuesta de estas preguntas? Yes. Or yes. No? yes. Okay. Yes, teacher. Ok. Ok. De las personas que no han participado. Uh, let me see. Veamos quiénes no han participado hoy. Ahí tenemos. Ya los vi. Ok. Diana ya leyó. Francisco Alvarenga, what is the answer for question number one? Francisco. A, B, or C. Which one is the right one? According to the reading. De acuerdo a la lectura, ¿cuál es la adecuada? Y... There is letter. There is... B. B. Call the person you refer to. Okay, let me ask somebody else. Eliane, is that right or not? Eliane. ¿Está correcta la respuesta de el compañero o no? Sorry, teacher, no lo escuché. No me oyó, okay. Yeah. I think a uh, little A. Letter A, do you think? Mm. Yes. Mm. No, 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 no. The answer was right because he said, call the person you report to. Yes. Okay, number two, let me ask somebody else. Vamos a buscar a alguien más. Oops, sorry, sorry. Let me see. Uh, how many people do I have here? Roxana, Edward, Diana, Francisco, Eleani. Yo, teacher. Okay, let me see. I have Carla. Who is saying me? Walter, are you? Teacher. Okay, give me the, the answer for question two. C. Let us see. Express the subject clear. Es, express the subject clear. Okay. What do you think, Carla? Is that right or wrong? Carla, are you there, Carla? Right. Is right? Yes. Okay. Number three. Numero tres. Let me choose somebody else. No se me escondan, no se me escondan. Ya los vi, ya los vi. Ok, Mengibar ya se me fue. Ok, a volunteer. ¿Alguien que quiera responderme la pregunta número tres? Uh, let it be. Let it be. Interrupt the other speaker. Yeah. Which is not good. Yeah. Ok, listen. Number three. Which is not good etiquette when you're talking on the phone? Is, do you say letter, letter B? Yes, letter B. What do you think, uh, Edward? Is that right or wrong? Yes, this is, is right. It's, it's right. It's right, okay. It's right. And the last one, if you receive a call while you are eating with co-worker, you should... Okay, who, who, who wants to give me the answer for this? A, B, or C? Me, teacher. Okay, tell me. 
Uh, is letter, letter C. Letter Leave C. Leave the table and answer the call. Ah, okay. Is that right, uh, Wilfredo? Is that right? What number? Ajá, lo agarré fuera de cancha. Yeah, my, my, my <laughs> little son needs some help. Okay. okay, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay, okay, okay. Number four. It's right, too. Um, oh. Okay. Uh, Maybe. Let us see, teacher. Okay, let us see. We need to leave the table and answer the call. Okay, is that right? Okay, we need to remember everything that we talked today because it, it is part of our knowledge that we need to put in practice while we talk right here, okay? Okay, before we go to exercise number four, three, because we are going to make a summary, five etiquette guideline from the article. Okay, okay, let us do this and not the... Uh, um, before to go to number four, I'm going to show you extra information. Okay, I'm going to give you like three minutes in order that you can make a summary and where you are going to find five etiquette guidelines for the article. That means that you are going to look the article again. I know that you have your books with you. I'm going to stop sharing this. Ok, en español y a colores, uh, les voy a dar un tiempo para que eh, me encuentren en el artículo cinco etiquetas. You can write it down in your notes and then we are going to talk about this. Only five, you are going to find only five. Solo van a encontrar cinco en lo que estoy pasando la lista porque ya es hora ok, let me see Ada, de Ada Daisy Ada Daisy is present no Alexis Antonio present teacher ok, Ana Roxana Present teacher. Christian Abdulio. Christian, no. Okay, Diana is there. Present. Edward is there. Present teacher. Eliana is there. Present. Fausto. Felicita Cruz. Present teacher. Francisco Javier. Francisco. Present. Okay, thank you, sir. Genara Ines Garcia. I have I haven't seen you today, Genara. Genara no, es, no está hoy, Genara. Okay. Helen Maria. No. Karen, Karen Yesenia is there, okay? Carla Marielos. Present. Leslie Fernandez. Leslie, no, okay. Menjibar Contreras. Menjibar Contreras. Okay, so please, I, I need that uh, you mute your, your, your microphone. Muteamos los micrófonos, por favor. Okay, thank you, thank you. I need to continue with this. Okay, uh, Gutierrez Sanchez. Margarita Stephanie. Solo la persona a quien llamo me responde. Puede encender su micrófono. Margarita Stephanie Gutiérrez. Is present. 
No? Okay. Rosa Esperanza. I present teacher. Okay. Walter Mauricio. Walter. Present teacher. Present teacher. And with Fred, okay. And with Fred. Okay. Did you find a fine etiquette? Teacher. Guideline. Dijo mi nombre. Yes. Margarita Stephanie Mejibar Contreras. Present. Sí estoy, sí estoy. Jesus. I called so you. Worry. And you didn't answer me, Margarita. Mejibar Contreras, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it's present, right? Okay. Okay. Tell me. Do you find a fine etiquette? En control asincro. O no las encontró. Okay, summary, fire etiquette, guidelines for the article, etiquette, guideline for the article. Okay, we want to leave it for the end. Okay, lo vamos a dejar quizá para el final. But before I need to share uh, an extra information with you, necesito compartir una información extra con ustedes. Can you see it? No? Pueden ver lo que estoy compartiendo? No, teacher. No, teacher. No, teacher. Yes. Solo alivio financiero, dice. Alivio financiero. What is that? What is that? The raining. Yeah, the raining is stopped now. Did, did, you, did you go out to get wind? No, I, I can't because I had to be right here in front of you, you know. Okay. Right now. Not right now. Okay, workplace. Etiquette manners, you know. Okay, let us reinforce the knowledge. Uh, vamos a reforzar el conocimiento. Uh, before to start, we are going to start talking about the definition of etiquette or etiquette, whatever you want to say. It. Remember the etiquettes uh, are rules governing socially acceptable behaviors. Son reglas que nos gobiernan. Eh, socialmente para una conducta aceptable, ¿no? The practice of form prescribed by a social convention or by authority. Son prácticas de forma ya prescritas por convenciones sociales o por autoridades. The word etiquette is derived from French, which actually means tickets. Eh, al menos el concepto que encontré es que derivado de la palabra francesa que actualmente significa ticket, your ticket to get in anything and any place you want. ¿Se comprende esa frase? Que la palabra etiqueta se deriva del francés en la cual actualmente significa ticket. Eh, el que lo lleva a cualquier lugar que usted quiera. Ok. It is defined as a good behavior which distinguish human being from animal. Se define como una buena conducta la cual nos distingue a los humanos del resto de animals. Ok. I think that is clear, this concept. But I don't know if you have any question. No sé si se entienden todos los apartados que tengo ahí de las definiciones. O hay alguna duda. 
is clearly. Okay. What about the rest? What can you tell me about it? ¿Qué dicen los demás? No creo, teacher. Okay, Wilfredo. Clear, teacher. Okay. Let us go. The why of etiquette. El porqué de las etiquetas. Okay, number one. Who wants to read it for me? ¿Quién la quiere leer por mí? El, la número, uh, la primera. Me teacher. Okay. To avoid negative confrontation. Ah, okay. Mire para qué vamos a usar la, la etiqueta. Para evitar el qué. Para evitar confrontaciones negativas. Exactamente. Negative confrontation. Okay. Uh, next one. Who wants to read it for me? Me teacher. Okay. Tell me. To avoid politics, a, I, a, in the office or workplace. Okay, it said, it said to avoid politics. I, e, I, e, I, in the office or yeah. place. Example, this one, I, I, in the office or workplace. Yeah. We need to, we, we have to avoid talking about politics, you know. Okay, next one. To communicate effect, effectively with an opposing, opposing opinion of another person. Okay. To communicate effectively with an opposing opinion of another person. Okay. Para comunicarse efectivamente con las opiniones opuestas de otras personas. Ok, next one. Me teacher. Ok. Go ahead. Vamos. Ah, no, that I can do it. It's no problem. Ok. Uh, to be organized in, in a uniform way. Ok, to be organized. Organized. And in a uniform way. Pues. Para, para ser organizado. Sí. De una manera uniforme. Ok. Next one. Hey, teacher. Tell me. In the workplace, tensions, conflicts. Ah, ok. Mire para qué nos sirven. To avoid workplace, tension and conflicts. Para evitar las tensiones en el trabajo y para, también para los conflictos. And the last one. Who wants to read it for me? To avoid employee stress. To avoid employee stress. Para evitarle el estrés a los empleados. Ok. Any question? No? No question. No question. Okay, let's continue. Okay, who wants to read this? Only the first one. ¿Quién quiere continuar leyendo? Me, teacher. Okay, tell me. A boy mis misunderstands standings. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Mis no. <laughs> A boy, dígalo, dígalo, teacher, ¿por qué? No? A, a boy. Está mi, ok, hold on. Difícil. Ok, 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 I'm going to do it. A boy misunderstanding. 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 Sí. Para, <laughs> para evitar que las cosas se entiendan mal, ok. Next. Employee job satisfaction. Okay, employee job satisfaction. Job satisfaction. Okay, say say this word satisfaction. 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 
Satisfaction. Okay, okay, again. Satisfaction. 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 Okay. Hay una canción que menciona esa palabra. Ca eso iba a decir de que hay que oír la canción para que... Y, y la dice bastante veces, entonces ahí se nos va a quedar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I recommend you to listen English music and that way you are going to learn how to pronounce some words uh, and you are going to use it later. A través de la música podemos oír cómo se pronuncian muchas palabras y luego nosotros las podemos ya usar en una conversación. Esa, esa palabra la dice, como ya dijo usted, la menciona muchas veces en la canción y así dice, satisfaction, satisfaction. And we can repeat it at the same time that we are listening, we can repeat it in order to get close to the pronunciation, okay? Okay, next. Okay. Who want to read it? Necesito que todos participen. Hay algunos que no les gusta, pero yo es necesario. Los invito a que lo hagan, por favor. Para que todos eh, podamos eh, tener parte en la clase. Hello. Se me durmieron. Hello, 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 teacher. Uh, Walter. Oh, teacher. Read the next one, please. Okay. Not yet. Not yet, okay. <laughs> okay. Siguiente, por favor. ¿Quién la quiere leer? Increase productivity. Increase productivity. Increase productivity, okay. Aumenta la productividad. Okay, next. Siguiente, por favor. Get the job done get 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 the job done yeah. um, get the job um. okay okay let me see somebody uh okay i request i ask you so please that only turn on the microphone the person that is going to participate the rest you need to mute your, your microphone, please. Okay, this, the last one. Oops, sorry. Okay. What about this one? Hey, teacher. Okay, tell me. To make to work play a happy three, is three free place. Okay, to make the workplace a happy, a happy. happy stress-free place. Stress. stress. Listen, stress. Stress. Stress-free. Stress. Stress yeah, stress-free place. Stress-free place. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, what can you, somebody wants to tell me something about the picture? What can you tell me? What can you infer about the picture? Alguien que me diga algo relacionado con la figura, con la imagen. ¿Qué podemos inferir? Um, the people is happy. I see the smile in your face. <laughs> in their faces, okay. In their faces. Yeah. That is the reason why we are talking about this topic. Okay, let us continue. Okay, etiquette, basic behaviors. Exhibited a positive attitude and pleasant demeanor. Use a fear handshake. Do you know what is a handshake, right? Maintain a good eye contact. That is really important. Do you know what is this? Maintain a good eye contact. Hello. Como mantener contacto visual? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Appropriate introduction, introduce someone by their title and last name, Miss, Mrs., Mr., Doctor, unless otherwise specified. Rise when you are introducing someone or you are being introduced. Parece cuando le están presentando a alguien o cuando lo están presentando a usted. 
be a good listener and soft spoken. Sea un buen oyente y un hablante suave. No necesitamos gritar. Show common respect and consideration for others. Debemos demostrar respeto común y consideración hacia los demás. Try to keep in mind. What about sensory reminder of how to get along in that workplace? Este es como un recordatorio de cómo llevarnos bien en el trabajo, ¿sí? Oh, yes. Okay, uh, who wants to read for me? ¿Alguien quiere leer por mí la primera línea? Mi teacher. Tell me. Monitor the volume of conversations. Okay, monitor the volume, the volume of conversation. Significa que debemos de estar controlando el volumen de nuestra conversación. De repente se nos puede elevar o se nos puede bajar. Entonces, we need to keep even. Debemos mantenerla así en un nivel. Así. Ok, next one. Me teacher. Ok. Keep personal telephone conversations and emails to a minimum. Ah, ok. Es decir, que no hablemos mucho por teléfonos. Nos vamos directos. Y as uh, we started yesterday in email, we are going to write down something brief. Vamos a escribir algo corto. Okay, next. Maintain privacy, keep all workplace conversations professional. Privacy, okay, maintain privacy. Keep all workplace conversation professionally. Okay, mantener privacidad, las conversaciones en el lugar de trabajo que sea profesional, avoid interruptions, use appropriate tone of voice, as I told you. Usar el tono apropiado de la voz. What about the picture? What can you tell me about this picture? They are showing. Yeah, and right here you can find this is a don. Eso es algo que no debemos hacer. ¿Sí? No es a quien grita más, sino a quien es más sensato. Remember that. Okay, continue. Sometimes we need to remove a slant term and use good listening skill. Algunas veces vamos a quitar como algunos slants terms que serían como modismos y usar buenas habilidades para oírle a las personas. What about the next one? What is the meaning of do not gossip? ¿Qué es eso? Do you know what is that? Chambre. Ah, do not gossip. Okay. Hay una serie que así se llama The Gossip Girl. La chica que le gusta, mire. Chambre. Okay. Uh, keep your personal workplace clean and neat at all times. Mantenga el lugar de trabajo muy limpio y ordenado todo el tiempo. Esas son parte de las etiquetas nuestras. Cell phone, turn it on silent or vibration. Su teléfono lo debe andar en silencio o en vibración. And... The last one say find out the organization values, philosophy, or conducted business, were ethic, and etc. Encuentre los valores de que tiene su organización, cuál es la filosofía, la manera de conducir negocios, eh, la ética en su trabajo, etc. Okay, let me see what else. Making a positive impression, arrive on time. Mire, estas son para que a la hora de, de podamos hacer una impresión positiva en nuestro trabajo. Arrive on time. Remember your manners. Be ready to learn, adapt, and change. Exercise professional maturity by showing good judgment and build good relationships. Tiene que mostrar madurez usted. A la hora de hacer juicios. 
para poder hacer buenas relaciones. Show a healthy respect for your colleagues. Hay que mostrar un respeto saludable a los colegas. Experience and expertise. Do not laugh at other witness. No debemos de reírnos de las debilidades de otros. Respond properly to your coworkers. Responderle apropiadamente a nuestros compañeros, supervisor and clients. And proper posture is important. This one is really important. Okay. And please and thank you. Use it often. You are going to use please, thank you, okay? Willingness to help. Debe estar dispuesto a ayudar. Mucho a respect and punctuality. Respecto mutuo y puntualidad. Teamwork. Espíritu de trabajo en equipo. Show appreciation and give credit for a job. Well done. Buena apreciación y dar crédito por los buenos trabajos hechos. Treat everyone equal. Tratar a todo el mundo igual. Try not step on anyone's toes or hurt anyone's feelings. Trate de no ir sobre nadie. Ni de dañar los sentimientos de nadie. Okay? Be kind, be courteous, be respectful. What else do we have? Okay, keep in mind that all the world around you. Remember, cubicle conversation and call can be heard by others. Recuerde que las conversaciones que se dan en cada cubículo pueden ser oídas por otros. Do not smoke or drink at your workplace. Do not speak, do not use your cell phone when you are in business meeting. Okay, thank you very much. And now we are going back to our Señor. material again. Okay, tell me. Se me durmieron. Por... permission to start, I have a work to do. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I got you, I got you. Okay, I got you. I understand your situation. Okay, somebody else want to tell me something about it? Very vo vocabulary. Yes, of course. Class. A, a lot of information. That I, sí, yo sé que algunas personas tal vez podrían decir lo satura demasiado, pero fíjense que toda esa información está bien básica. Y son puntos muy importantes que nos van a ayudar a relacionar el, el idioma con nuestro trabajo también. Entonces, desde mi punto de vista, lo, siempre que les presento alguna información extra, lo pienso muchas veces. Y entonces, y al final, bueno, tengo que tomar una decisión y digo, sí, pues hay que ponerlo y más de alguno le va a sacar provecho. Entonces, el objetivo es precisamente ese. Y con todo ese vocabulario que tienen en esa presentación, eh, los próximos módulos les garantizo de que van a ser un poco light for you, because han aprendido muchas palabras y más que van a aprender. Ok. ¿Alguien más? But the feedback we are going to do at the end of the class. Después vamos a hacer un feedback, ok. Now I need to go back again. Teníamos una actividad pendiente que no se me ha olvidado. Right here, we are talking about number three, summarize five etiquette guidelines from the article. Remember, in this moment, we are talking about the article. En este momento estamos hablando del artículo que leímos primero. Y usted me iba a hacer un, un sumario de cinco eh, etiquetas que se mencionan ahí, las que usted encontró, las que usted considera. Ok. I want to hear you. I want to hear you. Quiero oírlos, que ustedes me compartan qué es lo que descubrieron ahí en ese artículo de la lectura. Responsible teacher. Ah, ok. Which one? That we talk about that when we, when we have some trouble to arrive on time to our job, we have to call our boss 
okay. can report to the situation. Okay, okay. That we can be late. Okay. Teacher, tengo una consulta. Chao. Habíamos aprendido que cuando queremos, por ejemplo, decir to be punctual es como ser puntual. Yes. Pero si quiero decir eh, no hables en voz alta, obviamente ya no voy a ocupar el to primero. Sería solo el don't talk. Don't talk in a loud way. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Ah, ok. Sí, porque como siempre ocupamos tú antes del y para dar como cuando son como cosas así como eh, no sé si me explico, ¿verdad? <ríe> Entonces, cuando ya quiero decir algo negativo que no se tiene que hacer, es solo el don't y el don't, verbo. Don't, yes. Ah, ok. Gracias. Don't do it. No lo hagas. <ríe> ok. Okay. What about the rest? Estoy esperando eh, el summary de las cinco etiquetas de la lectura. Mi teacher. Okay. Um, be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisor. Okay. Excellent. Es otra de las etiquetas que aparece ahí. What else? Mi teacher. Uh -huh. eh, Expresa the subject clearly. Ah, ok. Tenemos que expresarnos. Expresarnos eh, con, claro. clar con claridad. Con claridad. Ok. Uh -huh. Um, other uh, is uh, usability uh, language. Mm, what about don't don't get confused with the word politic and polite are totally uh, different. Usipolite, usipolite, usipolite. <laughs> yes. Okay. Usipolite language. Okay. No se me confundan con la palabra politics and polite. Polite, with polite. Okay, okay, okay. What else? What else? Okay, by the way, do you remember the, the name of the person that is going to have the chance to be with me 10 minutes today? ¿Quién se recuerda? ¿Quién es la persona la, a la que le corresponde hoy la tutoría personalizada? Ah, ya no se recuerdan. No, teacher. No, teacher. No se recuerda. Okay. I'm going to tell you in minutes, okay? Ya le tiré en unos par de minutos entonces. Okay, let us continue talking about this topic. Okay, let us continue with the next activity. We have enough time to do it, okay. Okay, number four is your turn. You are going to work in pairs and you are going, you are in share of a group that is going to visit another company to make an alliance. Write your etiquette manual for your colleagues. Usted está encargado de un grupo de que, que va a ir a visitar otra compañía para hacer alianzas, para hacer una alianza. Usted va a escribir un manual corto para sus colegas. And you got an example. Eric and Manual is 2021. And, and, and we got an example here. Greet anyone in the facilities. In the facilities. And you are going to write down at least five, yes? But it mentioned that it's in pairs. Okay, in order to do this, let me see, I'm going to give you two minutes. Les voy a dar un promedio como de dos minutos y fracción. Le voy a asignar a alguien en el breakout room 
que va a ser automáticamente. Let me see how many people do we are now. Realmente estoy preocupado porque fíjense que a estas alturas solo tengo 11 personas conectadas. Entonces, sí, claro. eh, eso me preocupa porque eh, en una auditoría van a pensar a no sé qué. Entonces, eh, yo sé de que hay varios, por ejemplo, que estaban dentro y te, por cuestiones de trabajo se han tenido que salir. Y hay otros que por cuestiones de internet no han podido porque en, la, en el chat ahí me aparecen algunos mensajes de algunas personas que me dicen que han intentado muchas veces entrar, pero que no han podido. O sea, la plataforma como que no les permite entrar. Aclaro esto porque si alguien, alguna persona eh, encargada de auditoría ve el vídeo, pues que tenga claro que no es por cuestiones de de que los participantes ya no quieren estar en el curso, sino por situaciones adversas, ¿verdad? Y agradezco que me comuniquen siempre a, de antemano cuando existe algún problema de no conexión, ¿ok? Ok. Tenemos 11. Entonces va a quedar una, un run de tres. Veamos, tendríamos que hacer, uh, si tengo solamente... Eliani dice que la sacó la plataforma. Sí. Bueno, hagamos, oh. hagamos seis y le damos dos minutos. Ok. Let, let me see, let me see. Ok. Remember the, what you have to do. Ok. Here we go, here we go. Go to your rooms.
Okay. Eliane, are you there? Me sacó el grupo, pero no había nadie, teacher. Estaba sola. Sí, pero rápido me volví a sacar. Bueno, bueno, bueno. Algo está pasando ahí. Creo que es mi internet. Mm, could be. El problema es que hoy uh, todos los servicios de internet están fallando. Sí. Bastante. Menos en la factura. Son puntuales. <laughs> okay. eh, they are punctual. Ok, ok, ok. Ok, welcome back. Welcome back again. Ok, um, let me see the time that we have. Ok, based on the material now. After that you write down your manual. Ok, we are going to work in exercise number five. You are going to compare your manual with a different pair. Do the manual share several etiquette rules. Okay, how we are going to do this? Let me see in a different, let me think in a different uh, way. Okay, I'm going to mention a name. Voy a mencionar un nombre. And then I'm going to choose uh, other, okay? Voy a buscar, voy a mencionar un nombre y luego voy a mencionar otro. Y entre los dos van a comparar a ver qué es lo que tienen. Referente a las etiquetas. Let me see. Diana Carolina. Diana. Diana. Ah, ok. Diana con, con. Let me see. Carla María Los. Ok, compare your manuals. Veamos a, a ver si tienen igual. Van a ir, para hacerlo, van a ir leyendo una a una. Primero lee usted, Diana, y luego lee Carla. Al, okay. final, al final vemos si coincidieron, en cuántas coincidieron. Ok. okay. Do, do it, do it, do it. Do it. Eh, respect de, solo una pregunta antes de eso, ¿cómo se dice jerarquía? Jerarquía. Jerarquía, ok. Respect de jerarquía in the company. Carla, lea. Be responsible. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Siga. Show interest in the visit. Do not talk loudly will hear him. Uh, show empathy. Do, do not speak loudly to colleagues. Yo solo hice tres. También. <laughs> ¿En, ¿En cuántas coincidieron? En la de respect, creo que fue en la primera que, primero o segunda que ella dijo. Responsible. Perdón, escuché respect. Ok, only in one. Solo en una coincidieron. Sí. sí. Ok, ok. Sí, sí. Ok, Eleani. With, uh, let me see. see the rest people here. Elian is going to talk with Fausto. Fausto. Okay, teacher Eliani. You start. Se ha congelado la imagen. Ah, no, ya regresó. Eleani, Eleani. Eleani with Fausto, please. Se ha congelado la imagen de ella. Tiene problemas de conexión. Bueno, ayúdele. Ayúdele, señorita Margarita Stephanie Mengibar. Ok. Uh, I am 
start? Yeah, you, you, you can. Okay. Yeah. A boy talk about your personal problem. To a have, boy. Okay, okay. Uh, On, only one, uh, one. One and uh, one. To have rules of courtesy. Okay. Avoid arrive late on the meeting. No violence in the workplace. Violence, violence, okay. Use polite language. Uh, keep everyone's respect. <laughs> to be neat and clean. Do not talk loudly. Express the subject clearly on the meeting? Solo cinco is No more than five, okay. <laughs> how Make many any. How many do you have in common? Uh, cuántas uh, tienes? Any, any. No, no one, ninguna. guidelines. No <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, no problem at all. What about you, Edward? Edward and... Let me see somebody else here. Okay, we have Fredo Guardado and Edward. Tell us, what do you have? Uh, I you start. Have polite rules. Be polite when all college call you. No violence. In all place. Mention our process clearly. Social responsibility. Not interrupt, interrupt to our college. Be human with the employees. Avoid wrong interpretation of the people. Only. With that I, I only. I only. <laughs> okay, that's it. Okay. That's it. Yeah. Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, in order to finish the class today, uh, I would like to hear you what are the main points that we talk about today? Alguien que me mencione cuáles fueron los puntos importantes de los que hablamos el día de hoy. Make a, try to make a, a summary for me, please. Háganme como un sumario de lo que vimos. And I want to be sure that you understood exactly what I said, what I mentioned. And for today, Para el día de hoy, a la persona que le correspondía estar conmigo era a Helen María Chávez. Pero ella no está presente, I guess. Ok, para el día de mañana le correspondería entonces a Ana Roxana. Y comenzamos el día lunes con Fausto Ya se los tengo ahí marcados. Ok, uh, también uh, quizá volver a mencionarles. Tengo en el, en el chat de, de WhatsApp un promedio de 6 a 7 mensajes de compañeros que por diferentes razones no se pudieron conectar o no pueden conectarse en este momento. Ellos siguen tratando, pero no se ha podido. Entonces mencionamos esto por cualquier uh, cosa que pueda alguien eh, pues investigar y hacer cualquier otro comentario al respecto. Ok, let us, uh, let us finish. Let us talk about what do you keep in your mind that we talk today and share with the class. Me teacher. Okay, Wilfredo. I I learned today 
about that we have to to keep in our mind good etiquette on the workplace okay okay thank you somebody else Diana Carolina, do you want to say something? Your, your microphone is mute. Um, they use correct the etiquette. Etiquette, if you want. Etiquette. Etiquette. Okay. Et mm -hmm. um, <laughs> ok ok, alguien quiere continuar Try. me teacher ok we learn many vocabulary about manners norms of behavior Educate line. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, thank you. Somebody else. Ya en la última parte, que es la que estamos haciendo del cierre, ya no necesito estar llamando a alguien más, a alguien más. No, tan pronto termine el que está haciendo su participación, inicia otro y otro y otro y otro, ok hasta que yo diga ok, thank you, stop now please, cause of the time yes, has to be in this way ok yo sé que hay muchos que quieren decirme algo pero se quedan pensando y cómo lo digo, lo voy a decir así vamos suéltelo tell me Ya no espere que le esté mencionando su nombre para que participe. Entre más práctica hay, es mejor lo que se aprende. Ok. Veamos quién se atreve. ¿Qué recuerdan de la clase de hoy? Tal es about um, et, et, la good etiquette eh, in, in the, the workplace. Ok. Ok. Different so, etiquette. Different etiquettes. Okay. Different etiquettes in, in what in workplace. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Hoy voy a contar los segundos de aquí para allá, a ver cuánto se tardan para que hable el siguiente. Lo malo que ya se acabó el tiempo, teacher. No, el tiempo sigue. <risa> Para nosotros. Para nosotros, teacher. Para nosotros, teacher. Ah, ok, ok. Para okay. la clase. Ok, but no problem at all. No problem. No problem. No problem. Yes, it's fair. Okay. La, si hay... risa salu... sí. la risa es saludable, teacher. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I know, I know. Pero si, si, si alguien más quiere participar, eh, yo no me quedo cuadrado cabal justo en la hora. Okay. Sino, <laughs> sino que siempre. It is a good, she, she talked about a good etiquette teacher. We yeah. have to make phone, you know, yeah. job. 
Yes, Oscar. Oscar it is. But, 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 but in the right way, okay? Okay, somebody else want to talk about it? Yo sé que Carla quiere decir algo ahí está. Carla. Carla. The important etiquette. Okay. Está haciendo viento, mire cómo se mueve la cortina. O es el, sí, ya va a llover. O es el ventilador. No, oh. es que oh. ya va a llover. Ok, está weather. Ok, the last participation. Veamos quién quiere ser el último en participar el día de hoy. Anybody? Ya nadie. Ok, that's it. Ok, try to uh, invite the rest of people. Traten de invitar siempre a los demás compañeros. Don't forget to do your homework, please. Tratemos de hacer las tareas. Ya les dije, necesito revisar las plataformas o actividades. Uh, es muy importante y a uh, quien quiera la presentación de hoy solo me escribe para enviársela porque no me gusta enviarla así al, a, al, al chat de whatsapp porque va a ser que alguien no la quiera y va a ser nada no, mucha información entonces, entonces si usted la quiere y se le puede pedir las anteriores yes o sí. no Yes. No, hay, no hay problema. Solo me especifica cuál es la que quiere. Todas. <laughs> ah. Ahí le escribo. Ah, ok, ok. No Gracias. Problem. No problem. Ok, good evening for all of you. Thank you for coming today. Was a pleasure to be with you. Espero que les haya ayudado de mucho la clase de hoy, que hayan aprendido algo nuevo. En mi caso, pues cada clase que doy siempre aprendo algo nuevo de todos ustedes. Y es algo muy bueno. ¿no? Okay, somebody, you, somebody want to say something about it? No. Good night, teacher. Oh, okay. Good y, night, teacher. Y, Good be, night. y antes de que se me vayan, le repito a los que no les gusta hablar, por favor, estamos aprendiendo a hablar un nuevo idioma y la práctica es la que hace al maestro. Así es que afuera pena y a trabajar todos. Ok. Thanks, teacher. Ok. Bye. Ok. Bye bye. Ok. Thank you, teacher. Bye bye, everybody. See you tomorrow. Remember that, that tomorrow we are going to make a review about the topic that we have studied in this week. If you have any question, just write it down and keep it there and ask me tomorrow. Ok. Bye bye. See you later. Okay. Bye. bye, guys. Okay, see you. Okay, these days was assigned to a lady, but she's now present. Uh, I know that sometime uh, as participant, you have a lot of questions. But it is really important that you tell me what uh, you don't have a clear in order to help you exactly in the point that you need. In this case, in the day of today, we talk about etiquette and I share some information with you talking about the meaning of the word and at the same time uh, I share some information that is really important that we put in practice in our workplace in order to have a good relationship with the rest of people no matter if it is uh, the supervisor your boss colleague and so on this is a it's a nice topic I think 
because we need to know and we need to remember because maybe we already know everything about it but the most important is to put in practice and in that way we are going to increase our knowledge that is really 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 important to do it en la clase de hoy estuvimos hablando acerca de las lo que bueno en español referente a la parte virtual le llamamos netiquetas y son pues como reglas a seguir para poder tener una buena relación con los demás compañeros en el área de trabajo les compartí alguna información extra donde pueden encontrar eh, un gran caudal de vocabulario relacionado al tema eh, es muy importante el poder buscar el significado de cualquier palabra en su, en su diccionario personal algunas veces no es necesario saber la traducción de todas las palabras para entender un mensaje es solo de interpretar qué es lo que nos están tratando de decir entonces eh, pues a poner en práctica todo lo que vimos el día de hoy, a mantenerlo siempre en nuestras mentes para poder eh, ser mejores empleados, mejores trabajadores y recuerden de que persona que es puntual pues es reconocida siempre por esa responsabilidad de llegar siempre a tiempo y como decía alguno de ustedes, todo aquel que siempre llega tarde, pues él está en la mira, en el ojo del huracán. Y si nos está pasando algo así, pues debemos de ir cambiando, ¿no? Es, debemos de ser uh, open-minded, estar abiertos a los cambios, porque a veces nosotros eh, esperamos ver los cambios en los demás, pero... Si queremos que el mundo cambie, desde mi punto de vista debemos de cambiar nosotros primero. Porque al final, pues, como dice el dicho, todos, toda cabeza es un mundo. Y de esa forma vamos a ir haciendo la transformación de una sociedad diferente. Y por lo tanto, pues, hacer placenteros los lugares donde nosotros nos desenvolvemos. Ok. Uh, I want to thank you very much for watching this video. I hope that you can understand exactly everything. And I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you very much and have a good night.